Missing media? Broken links and family tree maker driving you crazy? In this episode, we'll show you how to prevent those pesky issues and keep your photos, documents, and videos perfectly organized. By the end, you'll have a secure, workable digital archive that functions seamlessly across computers. Let's dive into episode three, media management for FTM users. Why media management matters in FDM. If you're a family tree maker user, you probably face these headaches. Photos or documents not showing up in your family tree, broken links when you move your FTM file to a new computer, or a chaotic mess of unnamed files. These issues can make your genealogy research frustrating and risk losing precious memories. Today, we'll walk through five key steps to manage your media like a pro, ensuring your FTM tree stays intact and organized. Step one, how FTM handles media file storage. First, let's understand how Family Tree Maker handles media storage. FTM doesn't store your photos, documents, or videos directly in the tree file. Instead, it links to files saved on your computer or external drive, like a shortcut. To check your media, open FTM, go to the tree menu, and click the media tab. You'll see all linked files here. If you move or rename these files outside FTM, the links break and you get that dreaded red X. To avoid this, always store media in a dedicated folder like FTM Media on your computer or an external drive and keep it consistent across devices. Step two, linked versus embedded media. Next, let's clarify linked versus embedded media, a common source of confusion. Linked media points to files on your computer as we just discussed. Embedded media, however, is a copy stored within the FTM file itself, but this is rare and only applies to certain older versions or specific imports. To check, go to the Media tab in FTM, right-click a file, and select Properties. If it shows a file path, it's linked. If not, it's embedded. Stick to linked media for flexibility, but ensure your media folder stays in the same relative location to your FTM file to prevent broken links. Step three, moving your FTM file safely. Moving your FTM file to a new computer or drive often breaks media links, leaving you with missing photos. Here's how to move safely. First, back up your tree. In FTM, go to File, select Export, and save it as an FTMB backup file. Next, copy your entire media folder, say FTM Media, to the new computer or drive, keeping the same folder structure. Then, open FTM on the new device, go to File, Open, and select your tree. If links still break, use the next step to fix them. This ensures your media stays connected no matter where you move your tree. Step 4. Tools for batch relinking missing media. Broken links happen, but FTM has a handy tool to fix them. Go to the Media tab, click Tools, and select Find Missing Media. This scans your tree for broken links and lets you reconnect files. If multiple files are missing, point FTN to your media folder, and it will batch relink files with matching names. For example, if your FTM media folder is on your D drive, select it, and FTM will automatically reconnect matching files. Run this tool after moving your tree, or if you notice missing media, to save time. Step five, media cleanup and naming strategies. Finally, let's clean up your media and use smart naming to keep things organized. In your FTM media folder, create subfolders like photos, documents, or videos for clarity. Rename files descriptively, like smith underscore john underscore 1920 underscore birthcert.jpg instead of img underscore 001.jpg. In FTM, you can add captions in the media tab by right clicking a file and selecting edit. This helps you search and identify files later. Regularly check for duplicates by sorting files in the Media tab and deleting extras. These habits keep your archive tidy and functional across devices. By following these steps, you'll have a secure, organized, digital archive and family tree maker that works flawlessly across computers. No more broken links or lost memories. Want more FTM tips to supercharge your genealogy research? Hit that subscribe button, click the bell for notifications. Share your media management tips in the comments below, and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. 
keep your family history safe and organized, and we'll catch you in the next one. Happy researching.